Hey guys, so this is our series of the Omaha Zoo again. Um, I'm gonna leave every single video that we have for the zoo down below. Um, this first series, this first part of the series is gonna be the um, Desert Dome and then the Kingdom of the Night. And then I'm gonna do another one of the Asian Highlands and the African Grasslands. Um, group those two together as well. So this will be the same intro for both videos, but at least you'll know what we're doing here. So depending on what title it is, that shows you what level we are in our series. Don't forget to subscribe down below and hit that bell icon, like the video, comment on the video, share the video. Right, guys so we're gonna go into the desert dome we went in here before we're gonna link that video down below but we're also going to add in the kingdom of the night which includes like alligators and caves and bats and stuff so we'll see how that can go all right guys we're gonna go into the desert dome So actually the African wildcat is actually the closest descendant to our cat at home. Almost looks like Echo. This is called a blue-bellied roller. In the Sonora Desert. There it is. There's two of them. These are called the burring owls. 
They look pretty cool. There it is. Oh, there's another one up there too. Finally, we'll see it. So we're gonna go through Rattlesnake Canyon. Last time Amber and I went here, we didn't go through here. So I just want to show you guys what it, what it has. Some lizards. There's one right there. They pipe in like the little rattles. It's kind of freaky. We're over there too. Gamble's quail. Oh, there's one up there too. So we're back here. So if you want to miss the Rattlesnake Canyon, you come this way. That's where the bobcat was. Or you can just come this way. Box turtles here. Turkey vulture right over there. This is the swift fox. Looks like it damaged his eye or something. That's sad. That part right here, so cool. Here we go. And they have a little exploration area for the kids to kind of learn more about the cave and how sonar works and all that kind of stuff too. But we're gonna go, we're gonna skip that, we're gonna go right in here. This is called a mole rat. Oh, underground? And there's some up there. It's kind of cool. Oh, 
That's a fossa. I live in Madagascar. These are my favorite. Look at them. They're like little baby kangaroos. Cool. So, I don't know if you can hear, but the little girl is crying. It is kind of spooky down here for little kids, so be, keep that in mind when you come down here. Alright, now we're entering the caves. the most freakiest part of the exhibit. All these bats flying around. Entering the swamp. Okay, here we go. Okay, we're gonna see fish and stuff in here. We can't trespass, but we're going to head anyway. So we're going to look at the American alligator, which unfortunately lives mostly where we live in Omaha, or in, uh, in Florida. So. They actually pipe in hissing sounds, which makes it even more creepier. right over there sleeping Then they have an albino. This is right here. It's kind of cool. Where's that? Nutria? Or oh, they're in the box. There's a new tree over here. They have 
have beavers here too. Oh, those are beavers. It's right here. the swamp they have a whole nice little aquarium they used to have alligators in here but I don't see any oh there's one Snapping turtle, though. Turtles! There's two of them. Hey guys, so the video you just watched is the dome and the kingdom of night video. Um, I will recommend that if you go into the kingdom of night, just keep in mind that it is dark. Um, kids kind of get scared, especially when you go into the swamp where they do have the hissing sound and the clicking of the alligators and everything else. So it can be very intimidating. But all in all, it's really cool to see the alligators. Of course, we live in Florida, so we get to see the alligators sometimes firsthand on the side of the road and whatnot. Um, the upstairs where they have the dome, that's pretty cool. It does get a little bit warm, so make sure you hydrate and everything else like that too. Um, but it is kind of cool how they have all the different um, deserts and all that kind of stuff. But I do appreciate you guys watching the video. Make sure you subscribe. We will see you next time. Take care.